गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल लेट एस सॉल्व अ न्यूमेरिकल क्वेश्चन ऑन एजेंसी प्रॉपर्टी एन इनपुट डिजिटल इमेज इट इज गिवन टू अस द वी सेट इट इज गिवन टू अस इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ थ्री ग्रे लेवल्स वन टू एंड थ्री एंड फॉर दिस पिक्सल पी विच हैविंग द कॉर्डिनेट वन कॉमा वन फॉर दिस पिक्सल पी वी हैव टू आइडेंटिफाई इट्स फोर एजेसेंट एंड एम एजेसेंट पिक्सल्स सो लेट एस सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन सो दिस इज अवर इनपुट डिजिटल इमेज the v set it consist of three gray labels 1 2 and 3 and for this pixel p which having the coordinate 1 comma 1 we have to identify its four adjacent and m adjacent pixels so first we will identify this pixel 1 comma 1 in order to in order to identify this pixel 1 comma 1 let me mark the axis so this is our positive x direction and this with and this is our positive y direction along x the indexing will start from 0 so it is 0 1 2 along y the indexing will start from 0 so the indexing would be so the indexing would be 0 1 2 now 1 comma 1 along x it is 1 along y it is 1 so this is my pixel p having the coordinate 1 comma 1 Now for this pixel P, we have to identify its four adjacent and m adjacent pixel. So first we will solve for four adjacent. So in order to solve this question, let me give naming to all these pixel. For simplicity, let me give this pixel as name A. This is pixel B. This is pixel C. Similarly, this is D. Similarly, this pixel it is E. This pixel I name it as F. This is at G and this is at H. Now first for four adjacent pixels, for four adjacent pixels, we will target its four neighborhood pixels that is pixel b d g and e among these four pixel b d g and e which having the intensity value either 1 2 or 3 so clearly we can see pixel b pixel d and pixel e having the intensity value either 1 2 or 3 so four adjacent pixel to this pixel p are b d and e now let us Now let us solve for the m adjacent pixels also. Now, in order to identify these m adjacent pixels, let me first write the m adjacency conditions. The first condition. If Q is a member of n four P, and if P and Q belongs to the same V set V, if Q is a member of n four P, and if P and Q belongs to the same set V, we can say P and Q are m adjacent to each other. The other condition, if this condition it is not satisfied, we have to check the diagonal position. If if Q is not a member of N four P, and if Q is a member of N D P, then N four P intersection with N four Q must be equals to null. Okay. So first we will check. Q, if it is a member of N four P, N four P set we have already de de uh, defined. These are the pixels B, D, and E. So since pixel B, pixel D, and pixel E are four adjacent to pixel P, and hence pixel B, pixel D, and pixel E are m adjacent to pixel P. So pixel B, pixel D, and pixel E satisfy this condition. Q is a member of N4P, and hence pixel B, D, and E are m adjacent 
टू पिक्सल पी नाउ वी विल चेक फॉर द एन डी पी पोजिशन ऑल्सो फॉर एन डी पी पोजिशन वी हैव टू टारगेट द पिक्सल्स ए एफ एच एंड सी नाउ अमॉन्ग पिक्सल ए एफ एच एंड सी विच हैविंग द इंटेंसिटी वैल्यू इधर वन टू और थ्री सो इफ यू टारगेट पिक्सल ए एफ एच एंड सी अमॉन्ग दिस फोर पिक्सल पिक्सल ए पिक्सल एच एंड पिक्सल सी हैविंग द इंटेंसिटी वैल्यू इधर वन टू और थ्री सो पिक्सल ए पिक्सल एच एंड पिक्सल सी हैविंग द इंटेंसिटी वैल्यू इधर वन टू और थ्री एंड सिंस दिस थ्री पिक्सल्स ए एच एंड सी आर लोकेटेड एट द डायगनल पोजिशन देन फॉर ईच ऑफ दिस पिक्सल ए सी एंड एच वी हैव टू चेक वेदर दिस कंडीशन एन फोर पी इंटरसेक्शन विथ एन फोर क्यू इज इक्व टू नल और नॉट सो लेटेस्ट फाइंड फॉर ईच ऑफ दिस पिक्सल फर्स्ट फॉर पिक्सल पी एंड पिक्सल ए वी विल चेक वेदर द पिक्सल पी एंड पिक्सल ए आर एम एज एसेंट और नॉट सो फॉर दैट फर्स्ट वी हैव टू राइट द एन फोर पी सेट एन फोर पी सेट वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिटरमाइंड इट इज पिक्सल बी डी एंड ई पिक्सल बी डी एंड ई नाउ वी विल डिटरमाइंड द एन फोर ए सेट For pixel A, the its four neighborhood position. We have to target the pixel B and pixel D. Now we have to check among pixel B and D, which having the intensity value either one, two, or three. So both pixel B and pixel D having the intensity value either one, two, or three, and hence N for A set it consists of two members, pixel B and pixel D. Now we will perform the intersection between pixel between n four p and n four a. N four p intersection with n four a. We have to target the common elements. So the common element between these two sets are pixel b and pixel d. And if some common element exists, this is not an empty set. This is not a null set. so we will make a decision since n4p intersection with n4a it is not equals to null we will make a decision pixel p and pixel a are not m adjacent so pixel a it is not m adjacent to pixel p next we will check similarly we will check for pixel p and pixel h between pixel p and pixel h in the similar way we have to write for the n 4 p set n 4 p set we have already determined it consists of three elements pixel b pixel d and pixel e next we have to write for the n 4 h set For n four h set, for n four s set, we have to target the pixel G and pixel E. Among pixel G and pixel E, which having the intensity value either one, two, or three. So among G and E, only pixel E having the intensity value either one, two, or three. So n four h set will consist of only one element, that is pixel E. Now we will perform the intersection, that is n four p. intersection with n 4 h we have to target the common element so between these two set n 4 p and n 4 h the common element it is e so n 4 p intersection with n 4 h it becomes this set consist of one element that is e and if it consist of pixel e this set it is not an empty set this is not a null set so since n4p intersection with n4h it is not equals to null we will make a decision we will make a conclusion pixel p and pixel h are not m adjacent
right and lastly we will solve for and lastly we will solve for pixel p and pixel c so pixel p and pixel h are not m adjacent now we will solve for pixel p and pixel c so p and c we will check whether pixel p and pixel c are m adjacent or not in the similar way we will we, uh, in the similar way we will proceed first we will write the n for p set which we have already determined it consists of three element pixel b pixel d and pixel e next we will write for the n for c set n for c set for n for c set we have to target these two position pixel b and pixel e among pixel b and pixel e we have to check which among among these two pixel pixel b and pixel e we have to check which pixel having the intensity value either 1 2 or 3 so both of these two pixels pixel b and pixel e having the intensity value either 1 2 or 3 so n for c set it consists of two element b and e now we will take the intersection so n for p intersection with n for c we have to target the common element the common element between these two sets are b and e and hence it is not equals to null it is not equals to an empty set so we will make a decision we will make a conclusion p and c are not m adjacent so we have determined P and C are not M adjacent. So, so our conclusion is for pixel P, we will have only three M adjacent pixels that is pixel B, D and E. So now it's time to write our final answer. So for this pixel P, which having the coordinate 1 comma 1 we have determined my four adjacent pixels are b d and e and for us and we have also determined the m adjacent pixels the m adjacent pixels are b d and e now in the question as in the question pixel p it is re uh, represented in the form of coordinates so we will also represent pixel b d and e in terms of coordinates So for this pixel B, we will determine the coordinate along X it is 0, along Y it is 1. So for pixel B, our coordinates are 0, 1. Similarly for pixel D, for pixel D along X it is 1, along Y it is 0. So the coordinate for pixel D are 1, 0. And for pixel E, for pixel E, our coordinates are along x it is 1 along y it is 2 so the coordinate becomes 1 comma 2 so these three coordinates are four adjacent to the pixel p next we will write the coordinates for m adjacent pixels also pixel b we have already determined the coordinate it is 0 comma 1 pixel d we have already determined the coordinates it is 1 comma 0 and pixel E, we have already determined the coordinates, it is 1, 2. So for the given pixel P, having the coordinate 1, 1, we have determined its 4 adjacent pixels, we have, deter we have determined its M adjacent pixels, and with this, this question is over. Thank you.